welcome back to my channel. How's it going? I hope you're all doing really, really well. It's Degusta Box time. Degusta Box, for those of you that don't know, is a food subscription box. It's kind of all snacks and good stuff and I love it. It's £12.99 a month. I do have a code for £5 off so you can get your first box for £7.99. Uh, if you do use that, I will get points. And if I get points, I, get, I think I need 100 points and I will get a free box. So this box is actually a free box because some of you guys have signed up using my code, which is amazing. If you do sign up using a code, you will then get your own code that you can give to your family and friends for then you to see if you can accumulate points to get a free box. Um, I say this every month with the Gooster box. If you are somebody that shops around every single supermarket to get the best deals, you're probably not gonna like this. I like to do one shop a week, um, generally from Asda. Um, well, you might like it, but it's just, I get quite a lot of comments saying, well, you know, you can get that one thing from Tesco's for cheaper than that, and you can get that other thing from Lidl cheaper than that, but that would involve driving around to all the different supermarkets. So for me, I like this, because it gets us to try new things, and it always has lots of things in it that I wouldn't necessarily buy, but I'm always happy to try. So, yeah, let's just get in it. It comes by DPD. Yesterday I got a text saying my um, delivery would be today. And then this morning I got a text saying it would be between 10.24 and 11.24 and 10.27. Chris, my driver, arrived um, and I signed for it. And it is a nice big box, I can hear liquid. I never ever see spoilers for the Gooster box, so I have no idea what is in it. It comes like this, really nicely packed. We've got the bubble wrap to protect everything and it says open me eat me enjoy me Ugh. Let's... Ugh. Hit that. There. right so we have got some you always get your little card which tells you everything that's in it and then you generally get some vouchers so we've got some capsicana uh, latin flavor vouchers these are for a guacamole mix and a seasoning mix these are just um money off vouchers um i actually really like the capsicana sauces they're really really yummy so if you see any on offer get them because they're good right let's just jump in so the first thing i've got here is some crisps where are these um we're gonna get two flavors of these so these are london flavors so we've got this really snazzy packaging these are london flavors this is cheddar and red onion and a sea salt and malt vinegar. I like salt and vinegar and Ben likes cheese and onion. They've got really cool packaging. That's got Big Ben on it. And then this has got some snazzy ladies on it. These are 95p each. Premium crisps are made with best British potatoes, roughly peeled, seasoned with delicious flavours and hand cooked in small batches to ensure an even crispier quality. Um, there are four flavours. There's ready salted, cheese and onion, salt and vinegar. And then there's one with the dinosaur on it that I can't see what the flavour is. But it's green. I'm assuming it's ready salted is the um the one with the punk on it. But we know we'll never know unless somebody can tell me. So if you've got one of the other flavours, let me know so I can be nosy. But these are definitely get you. Um what have we got next? Let's go for you. We've had one of these before. This is a raw chocolate brownie. It's a pulsing. Uh, raw chocolate brownie salt is caramel flavour. I don't know if I've had this flavour before or if I've had a different one. This is one pound fifty nine. Deliciously decadent, healthy brownie, who knew that could even exist? Uh, crafted with the finest natural ingredients, this new salted caramel raw chocolate brownie from Pulsen is the perfect treat for a guilt-free snack. So this is gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free and vegan on Slimming World. This would be like 11 cents, which I don't think is going to be worth it. Um, but we'll have to see. If anyone um, likes these, let me know what you think. But I'm not sure I'm going to... Probably not going to eat the whole thing, but I'll try a little bit, but not right now because I've just brushed my teeth. Right, next up, what have you? Oh, I've got some miso soup. This is uh, miso tasty, aka red miso soup. This is £3.75, and this is made from fermented barley and soybeans. This moogi barley miso soup has a light and hearty flavour. Uh, the mushrooms add sweet earthy taste and are packed separately to keep your miso fresh and mushrooms flavoursome. Oh, that's good because I don't like mushrooms. So, the little mushrooms I can leave. Oh, these are seaweed flakes. Where's the mushrooms? I'm confused. We've got the paste. This just says peppery spices and seaweed. But it doesn't say anything about mushrooms. I don't know. 
I don't know. It says the mushrooms are packed separately. Keep our miso fresh and our mushroom flavour. I don't know. But I'm excited to try it. Um, I will see how many sins it is. Just looking on the portion. One portion is 45 calories. So two and a half sins per um, little sachet. And it says miso paste with warming spices, wakame, seaweed and spring onions. So vegan and gluten free. Add hot water. So it's just like a um, cup of soup. But a miso one. Yes. Right, next up, here's a capsicana. What capsicana things have we got? We should have two. So we've got a Mexican guacamole mix. Um, this is just add one avocado. I love the packaging on this. I think it's really cool. These are, this is 65p. And, and then this one we've got is a Brazilian, Brazilian smoked paprika and spices for beef or chicken seasoning mix. That sounds amazing. Sounds really good. We've got a chicken that we need to cook this week. We're gonna have Nando's, but I might do this now instead. Um, and this is a pound. Capsicana are proud to extend their exciting, authentic Latin American range. Just add Mexican guacamole mix to one smashed avocado, which is that one, and try the Brazilian smoked paprika and spice mix sprinkled on meat or on the barbecue or in the oven. So, yeah, and they are launching in, in large Sainsbury's this month. Um, I'm really excited for this one. I don't like avocado, but I have lots of friends that like avocado. And guacamole so i'll make this for them and see what they think right next up oh my god didn't know this all made fruit pastels <laughs> brown trees fruit pastels big sharing bag 30 percent less sugar one pound 29 100 percent fun filled introducing round trees 30 percent less sugar fruit pastels the sweets you know and love but with 30 percent less sugar um on cinnamon world these are per serving which is how much 12 sweets um like six sins so it's not too bad if you like jelly sweets it's not too bad um i used to love these when i was little absolutely love them but i didn't know they still made them so i'm gonna try one like say six sins for 12 so half a sin each i'm gonna have one now and i'll sin it and see what it's like i don't like the purple ones because i don't eat any purple food because i'm weird little mm. They taste exactly the same as when I was little. You wouldn't know they're less sugar. Mm hmm Ooh. Okay. I forgot how chewy they are. We've got a pear cold iced coffee with smooth organic milk. This is a flat white. Um, I'm going to put this in the fridge before we drink it how many sins are you 100 ml is 83 calories so that's four sins this isn't worth it for me ben will have this because this will be about i think 10 sins for this which is just not worth it um these are one pound 50 each and uh, we're a small bunch of coffee lovers who are passionate about bringing you the best beans that's why we've created this irresistible fair trade and organic iced coffees there's two flavors um i can't read what the other one is but this is nice this is a flat white so yeah ben loves iced coffee so he'll be super excited for that next up this is something i do like this is cadbury's highlights i love this stuff and i've actually just ran out which is really weird um this is two pound 99 cadbury's highlights milk chocolate is a smooth milky taste of cadbury's but with only 38 calories per cup i love these i mix this into quark or to yogurt to make a vanilla yogurt then chocolatey and i just have it as a hot chocolate because it's only two sins per cup which is mega yes and that's like a full size one that's ginormous okay next up we've got salad cream and it's still called salad cream it's not called sandwich cream i don't know if that actually went ahead or not but i know that there was a controversy and people were very cross that it was going to be called sandwich cream i've never eaten this i've no intention of eating this but i think ben likes it and so many people come to my house when they come for barbecues and they're like hey you got salad cream and i'm like no it's gross but i have it now all my friends who want salad cream i've got it one pound 49 after a century of being a must-have ingredient in lunchboxes and picnic hampers down the country. Hind salad cream still has a deliciously zingy taste that makes it one of Britain's favourite loved sauces. So yeah, anyone that comes to my house, I've got you covered now. Right, okay, so we've got flat tyre, sparking cloudy cider with rhubarb. Ben is going to love this. I'm sure we had something similar to this before and he loves that. Um, he loves cider. 
um, I don't drink it anymore, but he absolutely loves it. So many of these boxes, Ben's just like winning because he gets loads of stuff. They're two pounds. Lightly sparkling cloudy cider with rhubarb juice made with fresh pressed Herefordshire apples. This sweet and well-balanced cider is slowly matured and left unfiltered to create an uncompromising taste. Uh, ah, you can, I didn't realise, it's just so many airplanes. You can specify if you want your degusta box to be alcohol free. If you don't drink alcohol, you can. So we said yes to alcohol because we like it. Okay, next up, um, we've got some more bottles. This is Sparkling Ribena. Um, Ribena Sparkling is a grown up twist on a classic, this time with bubbles included. Available in two tongue tickling flavours blackcurrant and pineapple and passion fruit. This new drink comes in at less than 15 calories per bottle and should be available in pubs near you now. Can't get it out of Get out, you bell end. Crumbs! Crumbs, get out! Ooh, it's pretty packaging. Um, and these are £2.70 each, which is absolutely fucking ridiculous. In no world would I ever pay £2.70 for a bottle of squash, of fizzy squash essentially. Because if you think, if you go to a pub, you can get cordial and then you can ask for soda water for free. So you can get a shot of cordial for like 30p and then add free soda water. Is it just me being cheap as fuck? But no, I'm gonna drink them, but I won't buy them. No, no, no. Right, the last item. I'm a little bit sad about this one. I've just looked on the thingy and this is peckish rice crackers. And these look awesome. They're, um, these are sour cream and chive. They are gluten free, made with brown ri rice bran oil and baked, not fried. 100 calories, less than 100 calories per portion. So you can have a portion of these for four sins, which is amazing. But over here, it says cheese trays. This is peckish. It's a thinner, lighter, crispier snack made of rice and full flavour. We are baked, not fried. Um, and the one on here says cheddar cheese. I don't like sour cream and cheese. I've got a crown sour cream and chive. But this one says cheddar. Look, it says I should have cheddar and it doesn't say that there's an option of like two flavours, whereas all the other ones say you should receive either of these flavours or either of these flavours. This one just says cheddar. And I don't want this one, the goose box. I want the cheddar ones. So now I'm sad. Ben will eat these though, and the kids will eat them. I'm just sad. So yeah, that was my Degusta box for July 2018. Um, I really liked it. I am gonna, I'm excited to try the miso soup and the hot chocolate and yeah, the capsicana stuff. I'm really excited for this. So, yeah, I think it's really good. The only thing I wouldn't ever buy is these, like 100%, but I not would buy these ever for two pounds seventy each. That's just for drunk along. So yeah. I'm gonna go, if you like these videos, you know what to do, give that thumbs up button a great big bonk for me. And yeah, you should also hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on all the fun stuff that I've got planned for the summer. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.